It's been almost a year since we've had the opportunity to be surrounded by a bevy of artwork that is made of or inspired by sea glass. This weekend's event here on Fox This Morning. Let's go outside to Stacy with a first look at the 2016 Sea Glass and Ocean Arts Festival. Hi, Stacy. Hey there, Danny. Okay, yes, I'm standing here with Melissa, and Melissa is the spokesperson for this festival. So there's a lot of pressure on her. She has a lot of talking points, so we have to get right to it. <laughs> thanks for joining us this morning. Yeah, thank and thanks you. for being so tall and blocking the sun. <laughs> <You're welcome. laughs> okay, tell me about the festival. What's different this year? I know the mermaid is making a uh, well, is the centerpiece. It's going to make a big appearance, definitely. Um, sea glass is also called Mermaid's Tears, yeah. so we wanted to incorporate that. Um, but yes, the Santa Barbara Sea Glass Festival and Santa Barbara Sea Glass and Ocean Arts Festival, excuse me, um, is this weekend uh, at the Earl Warren Showgrounds. And we will be presenting over 40 different juried artists um, from Santa Barbara County and across the country. They will be bringing with them a variety of different jewelry, home decor, and a huge number of really gorgeous gifts um, that everybody's going to want to come and see and take home. Absolutely. I've already been shopping. <laughs> okay, let's go down the table. While you And we'll talk to some of the people who have created this jewelry. Um, Definitely a fan right here. Is this yours? You. Okay, what is your name and tell us, tell us your piece is a little about them. Um, my name's Eileen Cabral and my business is Art of Sea Glass and I've been making um, handmade, every piece I make um, is by hand and it's all pure silver and genuine sea glass collected from the beach. Amazing, amazing. Okay, I didn't want to skip over you. That's okay. I'm Delia and I designed the logo. Oh, and the mermaid. Marissa. Mermaid. And, and, yeah. You're sort of the VIP. I almost stepped right <laughs> past you. I apologize. Uh, now that mermaid, uh, Marissa, what, Marissa yeah. but um, the little pendant, is that, did you make that? No. Oh, well, whoever did. That's me. Uh, well, this is all my jewelry. Obviously, I need your catalog. <laughs> but I love the logo. I love the idea about it because sea glass, of course you think mermaids, the, the ocean. All right, we're going to keep moving down the table. Tell us, too, about your raffle while we're looking at more of this stuff. So we're going to be having a number of different raffles, um, and one of the big ones of, uh, is uh, was donated to us by the Santa Barbara Channel Island Surfboards, and they have brought to us this incredible surfboard, and that's just part, a small part of a huge um, surfing package that they've donated for the raffle, and I know our guests are not going to want to miss that. Nope. We're also <laughs> going to be giving away a Santa Barbara getaway, so you definitely don't want to miss all the... All run prizes. Kinds of goodies. Okay, let's move along the line. We have about a minute, so let me not skip over you, sir. What do we have here? Yeah, hi, my name's Alan, and um, I'm a little more in the ocean arts theme. Okay. I don't do jewelry, but um, I do use sea glass in a lot of my creations. Um, I use driftwood and reclaimed wood and sea glass and things that we I find on the beach. Love it. Uh, create artwork. All right, I got them. Keep going, keep going. What do you have here? So my name is Marcia McNally, and this is my jewelry, and I do a lot of knotting and braiding combined with my sea glass. It's fantastic. Thank you. Also need your catalog. Okay, and finally, oh, my microphone, does it stretch? Thank you so much. Over here you see some of the books um, from the, the guest speakers that will be available on Saturday and Sunday. We'll have a couple different guest speakers, and they will also be judging our best um, sea glass treasure contest okay. where the guests will be able to participate in the festival um, by bringing their own treasures to be judged and they can win up to $200 cash prize. You have a lot going on. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about it. All right, Melissa, thank you so much for thank breaking you. it all down for us. Absolutely. And thank you to the Santa Barbara Natural History Museum okay. and the Sea Center for um, sponsoring the festival and also connecting us with you. I think you got it all in. I hope so. <laughs> all right, I'm going to send it back to Danny.